What's up everybody? This is Chieftain and you're watching Lagging Out. Now being a small and modest channel like we are, only about seven to eight thousand subscribers, huge, 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 huge. it is proven to be difficult to find interviews. But here's a list of three people that I would love to interview but cannot. Nicole Arbor is the first one on my list. She's a Canadian actress and comedian, and she does a lot of social media type of content creation on Facebook and YouTube. She was most famous for her video of Dear Fat People. She is freaking hilarious. She's created a, a hashtag called Go Team, which is a great little hashtag that pretty much embodies how her attitude is towards life. I am kind of funny, but she is really funny. And if you don't know who she is, I suggest you go check her out. Number two on the list, you might have heard of him, Kevin Smith. He's a legend in his own part. He's a filmmaker, actor, comedian, public speaker, comic book nerd, I'm assuming video game nerd, and podcaster. He is a great guy and I hear he loves doing interviews with pretty much anyone. I was warned that he's a little long-winded. Before we jump into our thing, something happened right before we came out. But that's okay, because so am I, and we can always cut it down. Kevin and myself are from the same area of the country. He's from New Jersey, I'm from New York, and if you have watched any of his movies, they're very true to life, and he directs what he knows, and he writes what he knows. A plethora of knowledge of film, pop culture, and everything, and I think that would be a great fit for us at Lagging Out. One question I would probably ask him would be, So yeah, Kevin Smith would be my second pick. And if you know me and you're in our Discord channel, you will know the third person I wanna interview. I did a reaction video and an evaluation video of all of her videos, not all of her videos, but one of her videos and was very objective and very honest about it. Oh my God, I can't do anything. First of all, her can't picture should be a little bit same. bigger, but I, it, it's oh kind God. of nice to have it's it smaller because usually, Female streamers stop? have a Can lot bigger stop? image. I can't even get a thing in. <laughs> Are you both dead now? I have two Estes flasks left. Oh, I give it to Pickle P, really? Oh, I love Pickle P. Oh, girl! And she actually messaged us on our YouTube channel and we kind of like struck up a, a brief conversation. I belong to her Discord, she belongs to ours. This person I am talking about is Tara Babcock. Boobies. If you know me, I have an unhealthy affection for Tara Babcock. Boobies. Tara is a content creator on YouTube where she discusses everything from sex to video games. Boobies. Um, in the video, she essentially thanked me for not body shaming her and giving her an honest review. We chatted a little after, but our schedules never matched. Boobies. Tara has actually two YouTube channels and creates custom content for Patreon and is a streamer on Twitch. She's amazingly talented and beautiful and her philosophy is a body of a porn star and a mind of a philosopher. That pretty much embodies Tara Babcock. She's a really cool person. She will talk to you whether you're big or small giggity. Giggity. I'm meaning big or small type of content creator, but boobies. Giggity. I think it's pretty much impossible at this point to get an interview with her because she's consistently busy. Yeah. Those are the three people I would like to interview. Would you like us to interview somebody that you're interested about? Please comment below and let us know. But until then, cross your fingers. Hopefully we'll get an interview with one of those three or maybe all three. But cross your fingers, close your eyes, cross your eyes, and hope for the best. So this is Chieftain signing off and lagging out. Boobies. People that I really want to interview that are in movies, in film, are funny, are great, and engaging. Again, not saying that people weren't like that before. I'm getting myself in trouble here. But here's a list of three people that I would love to interview, but cannot. But if you ever see any of her tweets, any of her, um, She's created a, a hashtag called Go Team, which is a... <clears throat> One question I would probably ask him would be why he dropped out of the Vancouver Film School. But he dropped out of the Vancouver...
but he dropped out of the Vancouver film. I think I know why he dropped out of the Vancouver film school.